Hey, I'm Mushlings, and welcome back to this new episode of the Musha's Painting Academy for Beginners 101. In the last episode, we painted the gold TMM, and today I'll show you how to paint the steel armors with the true metallic metal technique. Okay, guys, I'm using these steel colors from the scale set. I really suggest them because they look great and the pigment is something phenomenal. You really should try. Basically, this method consists in three layers only and an extra colored glaze if needed. So the first step will be black and black metal. The second step will be just black metal. And the first step with max highlight will be heavy metal. I don't use any kind of washes because they will make matte the brightness of the metallic pigment and reapplying the base coat again is just a waste of time. So as we want to be more efficient, let's just start with a darker base coat. As concerns the lights instead, well, the trick here is to follow the non-metallic metal lights, which is a bit random with a main max light and a second light. What I really suggest you is to find a reference or more than one that you like most and try to replicate it at the beginning. After a few pieces, when you get used with the light locations, then you can start thinking to build up your own highlight system. So with any further ado, let's paint this Stormcast. I'll just follow some of the reference I had in my archive, okay? So this will be our palette, black, black metal, and heavy metal. Now it's time to apply our first base coat step. Of course, remember that you can still add a 50-50 mix with black to blend. And now we can apply the last max lights.
So here is the final result guys, I hope you like it though. At this point, if you like to, you can apply a yellow, blue or green glaze to color the shadows and make it look a bit more pro. So for instance, let's add some blue glaze. So guys, tell me in the comment below what's your method for the true metallic metal or if you prefer the non-metallic metal technique. Of course, if you liked my method, please thumbs up this video. In the next episode, I'll paint black armors, so stay tuned and warm up your brushes.